Okay, we are in Carlton North uh, on a second story veranda um, where there's a beehive in this vent. I, it's like not an ideal day, but it's all right. Um, they only moved in two days ago. They were watched moving in. So it was a case of let's just get here, get them out before they build anything. Um, there'll be a little bit, but there shouldn't be too much. So I'm going to cut the bricks out um, with a, a brick and mortar cutter and um, then give them a little bit to clean up the dust and whatnot. And then I'll pull bricks out and uh, um, use a BVAC to um, put them into a new hive box, then feed them in quarantine. We did the cuts around the vent. Um, well, we did cuts here first, but it looks like it's a chamber vent and not a f um, true double brick. So I've cut around the vent first and we'll get the vent out and that will give us a better idea of what we're dealing with. Okay, so we have Ali with us. Hello, Ali. Hello. See, she's world famous now <laughs> of my 128 followers. Oh, yeah. um, not that I do this for followers, <laughs> um, clearly. Um, we've pulled the vent out. We've still got bees clustering on there. And we've got the bees up here. The great news is that it's a boxed out um, vent. So um, the bees don't go further in the wall they go straight through the vent so that makes life a lot easier they've made a tiny bit of comb which I'll rescue and give to Ali um, but there's no honey in there of course okie dokies we'll start bee vacuuming and get cracking so I've been bee vacuuming for a little while uh, you can see um, they've built a lot in the last couple of days but um, it's a tiny cavity so awesome So when it was boxed out, it wasn't boxed out brilliantly. So in the upper right corner, you'll see there's some gaps where some bees have gotten up to, which we'll have to use some eucalyptus oil to get them out, as well as at the back, there's some gaps around the edges. Uh, so yeah, we'll, we'll just focus on um, getting the bees we can access out first, and then we'll get the eucalyptus oil and sort out the rest. And that's all the comb out. So now we'll be back the remaining bees, get some eucalyptus oil to get the other bees to leave their little hiding spots, and sort out the bees over at the bee vac. We've seen the queen a few times. She's in the cluster up the back, um, just near that uh, near the timber. So we're going to try to get the timber out. Um, I need to be careful because there's a chance the queen will still be able to fly. Um, so we do want to catch her and um, yeah we'll just see how we go. I've chipped away the um, cement, concrete, other mortar, that's what I'm looking for, <laughs> at there so I can get that timber out because the queen is behind that piece of timber as I've already said. Um, so we'll now get that piece out um, carefully and try to catch her. Okay and here you'll see we have the queen. So, yep, she's exactly where she was meant to be. Um, we'll show the landowner and then we'll um, finish be back in the last of the last of them. Okay, you'll see we've now sprayed the eucalyptus oil and you'll see the bees, they approach the hole but they hate the smell so they won't go back in. Um, we will fill that little cavity with rags though. Um, but yeah, we use the eucalyptus oil just to get the remaining bees in the areas we couldn't reach. Uh, Queen is in the box and um, we'll just vacuum up a few of the ones that are over there and then um, we're done. So we're close now. And there we go, so almost no rags needed. Uh, the bees chose a really tiny cavity, so they would have been swarming before the end of the season. Um, so it's almost like they ran out of options and just picked a spot rather than the perfect spot. 
So anyway, most of the bee suit, uh, most of the cutout, I didn't wear gloves or anything, um, and I'm not wearing my suit now. These bees are lovely, so calm. They're not one sting. So yeah, wonderful creatures. And and there's Ellie, run, running away. But bye. <laughs> It's a girl, because girls are in charge. Girls are in charge, that's why we like bees. Yep. Um, that's so Straight that, down. that's filled with, uh, with uh, rags now. We have Ali and I've forgotten Sam. her. Sam. Sam, yeah. there we go. Dr. Just Sam Dr. Sam and Psych Ali. Um, I'm sure they're an amazing match. Uh, and then we have the bees here. So, all, all ready to go off to quarantine and all happy, content, hum. So, we've done well. So, hope you're both happy. Good Thanks. job. Thanks so much. Yay. Best job ever. <laughs> <laughs>